everyone and welcome back to the channel it is me Raz back on Jones Dairy Farm and today we're picking up our 4955 sorry man you make that turn I wasn't in your way um so I did everything I could to get it up and working and well let's just say I had no luck my uh amateur mechanic skills couldn't get it up and running so we we had the shop come pick it up they came and grabbed it and uh, got it working cleaned it up for us and we're gonna put it to use today we're gonna do some hay work it is early in summer and it's supposed to uh, it's cloudy right now but it's supposed to clear up later on so uh, do that I also ordered us a flatbed that's what we have here thought we'd need one to start moving some equipment around. Also use it for bales and some other stuff, but mainly mainly to haul our equipment back and forth to the shop. Let's drop our uh Yeah. That's good. Engine running. Alrighty. Moment of truth here. Oh yeah, fired right up, and they cleaned this up nice. Yep, running like a champ. Let's back this up onto our trailer here. Oh, beautiful! Look at it on there. That's just pretty. That's what that is. Lift our gate up real quick. I don't think we have a way to... No. Sad. I was hoping we had a way to lock it down, but... So we'll just take it nice and easy. Head back to the, back to the farm and grab our, our uh, grass working equipment. Pull that all over to the shop and uh, grease it up, clean it up, make sure uh, make sure everything's up and running. We'll start with the mower because that's probably all we're going to do today. We'll go ahead and get a bunch bunch mowed, and that way uh, can sit and dry. We'll come back after it's sat for a while and do some raking, and uh, after that we'll bail it up. Actually, I don't, no, we won't bail up the hay. Sorry, we'll uh, we'll pick it up. Might have to order a part. I have that New Holland forage harvester back there, and I have that uh, that wagon back there, and I probably can. But I need to I need to find a way to get the hay off. And yeah, this trash just keeps blowing in after that tornado. To get out here and pick that up here later. Got everything cleaned up real nice. Um, got rid of all the trees and the branches, the trash. See the old tree trunk there. I didn't grind anything down. Come back later on, get it. Not too worried about it right now. Tell you what, we'll just drop right here. Let's do that. Jump up here, tractor. And just pull her down here into the yard real quick. I'm gonna leave it running. We get warmed up. While we do that, we will find a place to put our new trailer. PG trailer. I'm trying to think the best place to put it. But I'm going to put it over. Um, got a lot of empty space over here by the horse. By this old ho horse barn. I don't have any horses or anything yet, so. Just kind of park it right over here. 
keep it out of the way. I turn my blinker off five minutes later. That'll work. It's nice. It's trailer. Hopefully we get a lot of use out of it. Alright, let's get over here and uh, check on our tractor. It's had plenty of time to warm up. Let's grab the mower. Jump up here in the 4955. Run over here and grab our mower real quick. Take it over to the shop. Get it cleaned up. Tuned up, all that good stuff. Probably gonna have to sharpen the blades and all that, good, all that jazz. Alrighty, got that backed in there, and drop it, and we'll get this worked on, and we'll be right back. Alright, we got that, uh, the new Holland cleaned up real nice, look at that, looks brand new, all greased up, got the blades, everything all sharpened up on it. You're ready to rock and roll. Now, I don't have tons and tons of open free space to, uh, to mow. Uh, I do have, I do have a few areas that I can mow. Look at that. Fields are looking nice. Jump out here and take a look real quick. Oh, yeah. Got some weeds jumping up. We'll, we'll take care of those on a different day. Uh, things are looking, things are looking good. But I think what we'll do is we'll mow along this field, uh, along this fence line here. Yeah, I think that's what we'll that's what we'll jump in here and do real quick. All right, let's unfold our over here. Let's see, jump in my handy little PDA here and take a look and see what I. Tell you what, let's start up along the fence line. Come down that way. Maybe our best bet. I'd like to purchase one of these fields and make a really, really nice meadow out of it. I have a feeling we're gonna we're gonna need more and more hay as, as time comes on. So I think we can might be able to mow back on this way too. Cut whatever we can find. That's for sure. Let's uh, get lined up here. Alright. Put that down. Just mow along the fence here. Push through the bushes. The magic farm sim bushes that don't disappear. <laughs> Sorry, I had to throw that in there. Yeah, definitely. We'll get this all mowed in. Like I said, I think I'm going to mow here. I think I can do a couple strips there down to the barn. And, uh...
Switch sides here. Oh, got a little bit on the road there, but it'll be all right. We'll get it cleaned up. I think we'll I think we'll get a pretty good amount out of here. Start filling up the harvest store and see how it goes. I think what we'll do is we'll mow this side, mow down along that fence line. Um, don't own that lot back there. Mow kind of down to the barn. We have a couple other places we can squeeze in. That's what we'll do. I'll do that and uh, it's kind of hard driving this thing with one hand holding the remote for the drone so uh, do is we'll do that and we'll see you soon tell you what we'll do we'll just put it on the put the drone on follow and, uh, let them keep up with us for a little while. Alright, we'll talk to you here when we're done.